Welcome. You are at Agrisumat number one. Looking on sexy SP metallurgy at this moment. Let's move into the segment. All right. Experimental design. One mark. List of materials and equipment uses. One mark. Activities. Five or more activity describe it. Two marks. One to four activity describe it. One mark. No activity describing. Zero marks. Three or more photographs showing students engaged in this investigation. One mark. Data collection. Yes. Student. Every points are marked important. And I always get in. Student have no picture. Student save your picture and Google Drive. Or when you are doing your, your, your investigation or the activity, take picture, man. Take picture. Don't dash your points like that, man. It is your responsibility to make sure that you have a necessary criteria for your SBA. All right, next segment. Your experimental design. All right, look. You could have a giant. You could have a design. You could even have a picture of how your, your real experiment look. So you could take a picture of your cook and show us how it look. Or you could write a, a paragraph like what I have here. This the seven feet by five feet rectangular shape that was designed using the same size for a board feeder, water, medication, and same lighting arrangement. The only difference would be the bird feed. And the bird feed that I'm talking about is hyper versus neutral mix. So we are going to look which one can give can give the chicken more weight. All right, next section. All right, let look. List of material and equipment uses. This is a student. Make sure say so you know the purpose of the the tool, material, or equipment uses. You need to know the purpose of it. So we have the start of chicken. Super booster, water, feeder, feed, hyper and neutral mix, newspaper, derma, firewood, knife, tapalin, AFAR, pot, speed, vitamin. So student know the purpose of your tool, your medication, your feed, you know, know it. The purpose of it. Alright? That's why you can have an excellent SBA. Alright, next section. Five or more activity. Describe it. Cleaning your porch house. Preparation of brooder. Prepare foot bath. Wash water and feeder. Slaughtering. This is just a few of the activity. There is a lot more activity that I, I, I don't put up. You understand? So, whatever activity you do, make sure so you write it down and record it. Take your picture. Next section. Way enough bird. All right. <clears throat> Started to where the boiler bird from. They all until six weeks. <coughs> Every week, she bird from hypro and she from neutromix will be weighed and placed and scaled in a bag. The weight was measured and recorded. Student. The record keeping is very critical. You understand? 
So make sure that your, your, your record keeping is up to date. You have from this from the from set go, you should have your rec, you should have your little notebook taking down every little thing. You know? Alright, next section. Washing of water. That is a critical for your hygiene should be a priority. Yes, the water was washed every day to give the bird clean water to prevent the bird from getting any diseases. So, if your water is not washed properly or you know, wash it, high risk that your chicken can lose weight or get diseases. Yes, next section. Foot bath. Many persons may ask, what is a foot bath? Basically, a foot bath always be a little basin bull either on a step or in front of the, the porch house. And the purpose of the foot bath, you, you put disinfectant mixed with water and you dip your foot in it to prevent any form of disease to enter the cup. You understand? So, you don't want a disease in the cup. You understand? So you set up for sanitation purposes where our shoes are dipped for the prevention of diseases. Yes, man. Next section. Yes, man. Preparation of brooder. Remember, you know, this is, these are the five activities that we are talking about. There are, there are a lot more activity, but I just put five, you know, five. That, that is just the five that six require. Clean, number one, clean and sanitize water, feeder, and building. Ensure that at least three inches of fresh water, fresh litter is present. Ensure that adequate heat source is available. Set up brooder. Cover up sides with newspaper. You know, the newspaper. You know, you know, want the young chicken then digest any farm out certain wood and kill them. Turn heat and the source in the brooder. All of this is done at least half an hour before chicken <coughs> arrive. Hey, you have a, a, a good brooder, you know, say, your chicken going to give you weight. So make sure, say, your brooder in a good condition. Next section. All right, start tearing. All right. While a bird ready at six weeks, th things that we use for slaughtering, firewood, ice, poly bag, knives, and jump. The chicken was removed from the porch house. The chicken feet were tied with a string. Then they were hit with a stick on their head. They stunt the chicken, you know, purpose to calm him down, you know. But I don't want it into a bat on the winger, you know, rock winger and things like that. So stunt him to calm him down. All right, chicken head were removed with a sharp knife. The blood of the chicken was drained out properly. So if if the blood not drain out properly, you know, chicken will easily spoil, you know, so you want to make sure you say the blood drain properly. Chicken were placed in boiling water. You know, you, you want to make sure that they oh, remember, you know, you want to put the, the chicken in a good temperature. You know, want the water to hot. So, you know, so you have to have it on the right temperature. Yes, the chicken were dipped, dipped into the boiling water for the removal of feather. Nine said the chicken were washed and placed in a jump of ice water to chill for a period of time. Ten said chicken were placed in poly bag for storage in deep freeze for marketing. Chicken were sent 
to the school staff and canteen. <coughs> right? So, this is just a, a idea of how you're slaughtering. You know? The procedure of a slaughtering should look. You know? Alright? Next section. Three or more photographs showing students engage in this investigation. And this is one of the things that I'm really emphasizing that. Sometimes students as you know, students not take no picture when they are doing their activities. Who have picture, phone mash up, phone distract. Student, save your picture and Google Drive. You still have access to your, your picture when you save them on Google Drive. Next section. All right. This picture showing when Yeah, so as you can see, you're showing the chicken on a scale. You understand? So a weight pressure when you slaughter a chicken, the weight is very critical. So this, as you can see, a chicken, chicken meat, a weight in bag, not, not live chicken. It's a dead chicken. All right. This picture into the feathering of the chicken. You know, so as you can see, students are removed the feather for the, the meat. You know, for nobody want to have feather and then chicken meat. So feather have to remove. Next section. This picture showing putting feed in the border for the young chicken. All right. This is very critical, you know, because when a chicken them just come, you know, you want them to have a little experience. <coughs> so you, you, you throw a little feed on the ground for them to start get used to the feed, because when them just come, they are all, you know. And if you observe closely, you see some stone in the water. You know, the reason why we, we put this stone in the water we keep the, the chicken that's then wet up themselves. You know, so only the only the chicken head can go go in not the whole body. But you know that every chicken gets wet, you know, chicken going to die. You know, so next section. Yes, man. All right, data collection. These are very critical part of the SPA. You know, this part, if if anything go wrong, you can basically lose a lot of mark from your from your result 
and a data collection. So we have to get this right. All right. This is what we will be doing for the next six weeks. A, chicken will be way for six weeks. B, for the six weeks, three chicken will be way for each side. C, after word way, three chicken from hypro and three chicken from Nutramix. D, then record the weight of the chicken and compare both Nutramix and hypro. E, when the six week end. F, then calculate both hyper and neutral mix to find out the one which gain more weight and to calculate the average weight of chicken and average weight gain of chicken. So basically, this is what. Now, after you get all of this, now you are going to, in the visual section, you are going to show your figure. And that is when you are going to do your calculation. You know, so that is 